Hey guys, and welcome back into Anno 1800. Now I know what you're probably thinking. You saw the title of this episode and you're like, wait, what? Well, yeah, it's true. This is going to be the final episode for St. John's Bay on the channel for this current season of Anno 1800. A few things kind of have come up throughout the day that I've been thinking about in regards to the Sunken Treasures DLC that's coming out. And I've decided that I think it'd be best if I start a brand new game for that. Jumping into the new DLC with a, what, $86 million bank account, $190,000 income, you know, plenty of goods and materials and a new world all set up and ready. It gives us a good head start into the into the Sunken Treasures DLC and the campaign there, but I think it would be interesting to start with basically nothing and just rebuild an entire new network of trade routes and set everything up from the beginning and grow that city with no uh, bonuses. There's also the advent of all of the new uh, crafting system that's coming with Inventor with Old Nate. So there's a whole new crafting system for us to explore and everything else. And I just, I think it'd be really cool to go in and do all that with no help from a established, very wealthy uh, island empire that we already have right here. So given that, I have decided that we're just going to start with a whole brand new game next Tuesday, July the 30th. When Sucking Treasures comes out, I'm, I'll probably just build a small starter city and get myself up to about 700 artisans or close to 700 artisans. That's the unlock number you need to trigger the new DLC content. So I'll get just under 700 and then I will the very first episode of the new season with Sunken Treasures will be me unlocking that campaign for that new city and going up there and starting a brand new whole brand new thing starting all over from the beginning we'll have new ais i'm going to choose some different ais next time different setup on the islands and the maps and everything it's just going to be a whole new whole new thing i have thoroughly enjoyed building this city with you all and watching it grow watching seeing myself get better with the city building and the city planning how it looks the aesthetics of it and understanding more and more about production systems and just just all the complexities of this game i've really really had a great time with it i really hope you have too um this is just gonna be a short episode i'm not really gonna do much there's not i don't want to get into anything just to leave it on a cliffhanger you know we we've i've done really well with the city i've got eight thousand investors i could go ahead and bump that on up and get uh to ten thousand investors to unlock the uh the sumptuous exhibits here which you need 10,000 investors for. But I think that'd be kind of a fun now. thing to save for our Sunken Treasures DLC uh, at Cape Trelawney, which is the name of the new region and the new uh, continental landmass that you are going to be building a capital city for the Empire on. So there's a, there's a lot of stuff I really want to save for that Sunken Treasures DLC. And a lot of surprises for myself and everything else I don't, that I'd like to save. So with that... Thank you so much for joining me here in St. John's Bay. We we have really built a really awesome city. I will probably continue building this city up over the next few days. I'm I'm still having fun with the game. I want to play. I just I want to build it up, finish this city off, and just tinker around with it aesthetically. And then I'll probably post some pictures on Twitter of the final results, uh, just to show you kind of what I ended up with. And then next Tuesday, July 30th, be ready because I'm going to be diving head first into the sunken treasures dlc that day i'm i'm taking off of work i'm going to record several episodes we'll probably get back to the two episodes per day because i'm going to be uh going at it pretty hard with that new dlc that is a you know this is one of the actually i think this right here is one of the largest land masses if you don't count that river like these cape trelawney is three times bigger so you know three times the space of these islands right here it is massive so it's going to be a great map to play on i'm really looking forward to the new dlc dropping um and it's probably going to be the only dlc dlc i do that with just kind of depending on how many episodes we get into before botanical gardens and the passage come out you know i don't want like a 130 episode long let's play series but 
I mean, if we get there, we get there. People are still watching it. Then, hey, I guess you're going to still enjoy it. Um, the Passage, which will be the third DLC coming out later on, is going to be a little different. It does include a new session, but it will also have all brand new production chains, a new uh, tier of residents that you build to, and all of that. There, there might be an actual good reason to continue from a current save game in that one. But with Sunken Treasures, I feel like it'd be really good to start over and start from the beginning start from scratch and build it all up again so i hope you understand i hope that you don't get too upset that i'm going to kind of cut this series off right here and be done with it again this has been a learning experience for me um, i've had a lot of comments privately to me about my series and people like hey you know i really liked what i saw in there that really helped me thank you for giving me that information so I'm really glad this series has helped people, and uh, with my knowledge increasing with this game, I'm really hoping to be able to give even better advice and even better tips and stuff for you in the future in uh, Season 2 of Anno 1800, which will be starting next week. So with that, guys, here's one last look at our wonderful city that we have built here. Again, I'm going to continue playing this map and continue building it uh, at, my, at, my, at my own pace, at my own leisure. And then I will post pictures of the final product on my Twitter page, which you can find the Twitter page linked in the description below. Keep track of things there. I post there all the time, even though I have like two followers at the moment. I do post there about what's going on, you know, when uploads are coming for different games, what my plans are. I try to post screenshots. So do check that out. Um, if you are excited for the Sunken Treasures DLC coming out here pretty soon and a new start to the series and a new uh, map and everything else, go ahead and drop a like down below. Let me know what you thought of this series and uh, what, you know, give me some feedback. What can I do different? What would you like me to do different in the new DLC map that's coming out? And just, uh, you know, just let me know what you'd like to see. You know, I, I make these videos for me just as much as I make them for you. So I would love to see uh, some feedback on everything and uh, get some interaction with you all. I, I really appreciate all of the support, all of the subscriptions I've gotten so far. It means a lot to me. I know I don't have thousands of subscribers. I've got about 54 of you all right now, and I'm very grateful for each and every one of you. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. And end St. John's Bay as a Let's Play series here on an awesome note. I've had a lot of fun with it. And I will see you all in one week with the Sunken Treasures DLC. Until then, guys, take care.